For me, spiritual intelligence is that inner wisdom, that inner knowledge, that deep understanding, that kind of inner learning that is within each and every one of us. And that intelligence really knows the ultimate plan of our lives individually, as well as the ultimate plan of all lives, individual and collective plan. And really, you know, to put it very simply, it is a complete inner guidance system. You know, many people think of their spiritual intelligence as their intuitive thinking, their inspired ideas, their creative ideas. And, and also for many people, they access its wisdom when they need help solving problems. And, and let's face it, we all need some help sometimes, don't we, with the challenges, the issues and, and the problems that come up in our lives. And I think the value of using spiritual intelligence for helping kind of in our problem solving repertoire, if you like, is that because our spiritual intelligence can see the wider plan of our lives, it can see the bigger picture, it knows how things are ultimately meant to work out. And it also knows much more than we know. And if you think about it, when an issue arises, you know, can we never ever know the full facts, do we? We may think we know everything, we may think we know what's going on with people, but we never really quite know exactly the full facts and what really is going on with people. And yet our spiritual intelligence does. And that's why it can guide us so easily to a win-win situation. And, you know, we don't really have great predictive powers, you know, some of us have developed psychic un understandings, but often they can be slightly off, they can at times be wrong, yet our spiritual intelligence can and does know what the future holds for us. And I think most importantly, the reason why it's so valuable to rely on our spiritual intelligence is because it doesn't have all the kind of mental filters in our situations when we're looking at the challenges in our lives that we need solutions to. So calling upon your spiritual intelligence, using it as the, the, the guiding answers that come to you is just so valuable. And personally, I try to refer to it as often as I can throughout the day. And it is just that wisdom that is inside of us, that if we quiet our mind, if we still our mind, can actually give us a really creative and inspired answer, can really see what is the right action for us to take. So spiritual intelligence is very much a transition, a transition from being very outer directed, very affected by our circumstances and our life events. You know, we place a lot of store, don't we? And I'll be talking more about it in a moment on the outer situations of our lives. And yet our spiritual intelligence is always guiding us inwards. It's guiding us to listen, to still our minds, to focus our minds in quietness and just to, to meditate, to listen. And you know, meditation really is just focusing the mind, it's nothing more than that. But by focusing the mind on the breath, perhaps just on noises, on sounds that you can hear, or deep within yourself, it allows you to be less kind of affected by what's